So here is a question where we're given the value of, of x and of z and we're asked to use the formula z equals xy squared to calculate the value of y. So let's write out of that formula and sub in x and z. So we've done that here. We're now just going to find y squared. So see if you can find y squared and simplify it down as much as you can. Okay, so you can divide by the 3 times 10 to the minus 6. And now we can simplify this down further because we note that when we have powers we like this where we're dividing, we subtract them. So we do 13 minus minus 6. And this is going to give us 10 to the 19. And we can, we're multiplying this by the 1.2 over 3. Now, 1.2 over 3 is 0.4. So we have 0.4 times 10 to the 19, which is the same as 4 times 10 to the 18. And so we get this for y squared. So let's carry on. We need to square root this to find y. Um, and when we square root 4 times 10 to the power of 18, we square root the 4 and get 2. And we square root the 10 to the 18 and get 10 to the 9, because 10 to the 9 squared would be 10 to the 18. It's important to note we can, we can do the square root in separately like this because we have multiplication. And when we're doing the square root of AB, this is equal to the square root of A times the square root of B. It's not the same when we're adding, it's just when we're multiplying like this. And so we get our answer of C.